But uh, yeah, Freddy Krueger, he's more of like, you know, if you grew up during the 80s and 90s, you're kind of mascot. But if you're like, you know, a kid nowadays, you're like, oh, totally Freddy Fazbear. Although I'm not gonna lie, guys. I mean, no offense to Freddy Fazbear. Freddy Krueger, oh God! Hey, 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 guys, it's me, the Gaming Grape, and I'm back on the fruitiest, tootiest, most insane gaming channel of all time. Annoying Orange Gaming, of course. Oh, gosh. Oh, we're going into a planet here. I don't know what's going on. It's Night Day Studios. Oh, my God. Everyone's floating in the beautiful purple sky. Purple diamonds in the purple sky. Welcome, and uh, today I'm playing Roblox Labyrinth. Not to be confused with the 1980s film starring David Bowie, but, uh, you know, use your own imagination. Get out of here, let's go. 249,000. Yeah, I told Orange, I was like, dude, I think you've been playing on my account. Or, well, I've been playing on his account, and, uh, well, I changed the skin color to my color, and, and then I think he got on the other day and started playing, and he didn't realize it. But, <laughs> ah, well, what you gonna do? What you gonna do with all that stuff? All that stuff inside your trunk. I, I throw it away, if I were you. Um, so yeah, look, there's me. I'm the grape. You like my, uh, my spiky arms? I took that, uh, from the armor. I kind of like how Midget Apple designed his costume, so I was like, uh, I'm gonna change it up a little. And I gotta, I gotta put the hat on. The hat's like me. It's like totally me. Do you guys think I should be, like, I should add a hat? Do you, you think they should give me a hat instead of the headphones? Well, the headphones kind of tie me together since I'm like the gaming great. But, you know. Ooh. Yeah, it's a stick. I'm gonna stab you guys. It's gonna be great. Yeah, guys. Sorry. My, my mouth is, uh, it, it's kind of hurting today because I have TMJ. So, uh, that's why my voice sounds a little different if you're like, what's going on? And then if you're not, then just ignore it. But, yeah. It's, uh, it's when your jaw muscles get, like, tender, tender muscle jaws. TMJ. Yeah, I, I feel really bad for anyone that has it, but uh, I just want to put it out there. There's nothing wrong. It just, it just happens, you know, to grapes, and it happens to people, too. So j j just be careful, guys, okay? D don't go be popping and locking any, any parts of your jaws up there. Uh, you might have to go to the, the, the dentist. The dentist. Hmm, titty pretty. Okay, all right. So I'm in a... Pyramid. Oh god, I burned alive! Oh, just like Gollum at the end of Return of the King. Alrighty, I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready for Freddy. Um, Freddy Fazbear or Freddy Krueger? I don't know. You pick. Who's your favorite Freddy, guys? Freddy Fazbear or Freddy Krueger? Like, I mean, if you had to pick. I mean, uh, come on. Just just think about it and uh, and I'll try to think about not falling into the hot lava. But uh, yeah, Freddy Krueger. He's more of like, you know, if you grew up during the 80s and 90s, you're kind of mascot. But if you're like, you know, a kid nowadays, you're like, oh, totally Freddy Fazbear. Although I'm not going to lie, guys. I mean, no offense to Freddy Fazbear. Freddy Krueger. Oh, God. <sighs> okay. Now try not to do that again. Jeez, they really laid on you. You got a penalty. Well, I'm doing my best. Just come. Whoa. Hmm, that was a glitch in the Matrix. I don't think that should have happened. I should have totally died. Oh, well. But I didn't. I didn't die because I'm awesome. I'm so awesome. Jumping like a frog. All of oh, gosh. Come on. A frog would not have done that. Actually, a frogs have no coordination. So they, they, they'd be jumping like crazy. But they jump right into the lava, probably. Um, all right. Mm, that's a cool temple. But, uh, oh, is this the easy way out? Yeah, I don't even know if I'm going to be able to get in there. This is, not even Indiana Jones could weather this one, guys. This is like a, the Temple of Doom times a thousand. Oh, really? You're going to put a bunch of blocks in the door to block us out? Hey, get us? They're blocking us out. That must be why they're called blocks. <laughs> Sorry, guys. I'll stop acting like a blockhead for one second and try to figure out how to get to the center of this pyramid. <laughs> oh, God, no! Oh, oh man, I always thought I fell into a bottomless pit of fire and fury. Oy, oy, oy. So, I'm really... I meant to do that. I committed suicide on purpose, all right? Um... Yeah, I don't know. Anyway, uh, getting back to our Freddy conversation, uh, which I was really just having with myself, I I, I think Freddy, Freddy Krueger could probably destroy Freddy Fazbear. Although Freddy Fazbear is not really human, he's an animatronic, so... Then again, maybe not. Actually, if Freddy Fazbear could bring Freddy Krueger out of the dream world into the real world, then he might have a chance of beating him. Sort of like in that movie, Freddy vs. Jason. Although I think Freddy won in the end, 
I'm gonna, just, I'm just throwing it out there. No offense to Friday the 13th fans who like Jason Voorhees, but. Oh God, did you hear that? Oh, I gotta stop talking bad about Friday the 13th. Jason Voorhees is gonna come and slash and dice me up and cut me up into a uh, grape puree. Oh, I'm gonna make jam out of me. That would be bad, bad, bad. Oh, come on. One of these days, guys. Maybe I should take another route. Well, there's like four routes here. So, how about, let's go in here. These look like a bunch of dodgy things I can get past. Yeah, no problemo. No problemo, man. I can do it. Oh, yeah, yeah. Welcome to the center of Coolsville. Population, us. Ooh, look at that. Check it out, check it out. I'm doing it, I'm doing it, I'm doing it. Oh, shoot. Come on. Come on. Whoa, come on. All right, you gotta time it perfectly. Whew, now that was some Indiana Jones action right there. Oh man, more? All right, we can do it. You can do anything, you put your mind to it. Oh yeah, look at that. I still got my little crossbow, my little like spiky thing I can stab enemies with, although there's no enemies in here whatsoever. It's just, it's just like booby traps, you know? Booby traps everywhere. Okay, I can do it. Uh, and, oh jeez. I don't really wanna die. I hope I don't die. Okay, uh, Joe Gush. Oh my gosh, okay, okay, oh gosh. Oh gosh, oh Josh Gad, okay. <laughs> Uh, this is like gives a whole another meaning to the, the game. The floor is lava. Everything's lava here. Oh, I made it. Okay. Okay. I did it. I did it. I did it. Um, what else is over here? I don't know. Huh? Oh, oh dang it. Oh, I'm so angry. Man, this is a really hard level. Jeez, eat your heart out, Indiana Jones. I don't even know if you could do this. All right, I'll try this one more time. One more go around. One more go around, and then we're gonna beat it or eat it. I'm probably gonna eat it. I'm gonna be honest with you. I'm probably gonna eat this one. I'm giving my all, guys. Uh, this is not easy. This is like, this is labyrinth times a thousand. Oh, this is another one. Well, I got farther here. So I guess I get a ride on the little light stands or whatever the heck those things are. They're not floating platforms or hanging platforms. Huh. Seems to be like a bunch of secret cases and boxes uh, surrounded by flames and other kinds of dangerous things that you can get to in this game, but I, I just haven't figured out how yet. Um, all right, come on. Uh, jump over here, jump over there, and jump everywhere. Okay, whoa, almost fell. Jump up, jump up, and get down if you want some ice cream. I want some ice cream. Do you want some ice cream? Why don't you scream for some ice cream? That was my new ice cream song. You guys like it? I'm working on it. Yeah. I literally just started working on it like five seconds ago. So yeah, we'll see how it goes. I'm thinking like, you know, top of the charts, number one, like, you know, move over Adele. There's a new grape in town, that kind of thing. I, I could totally pull it off, you know? Maybe Adele will get like a sore throat and she'll be out for like a year and it'll pave the way for me, the gaming grape, to start my insanely awesome rock and roll music career. And again, maybe not. I could fall on some hot lava and never be seen again. All right, I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna jump over here. I did it! Oh, yeah, yeah! All right, all right, all right, oh, come on! Oh, yeah, yeah. Well, I'm not cold, that's for sure. I'm pretty warm, but this is really getting on my nerves. Uh, all right, let's get out of this pyramid. Let's go check out and see what else they have around this labyrinth they call. Maybe they got like a, a minotaur, or like, I don't know, maybe, maybe David Bowie will pop up and be like, I'm Jareth the Goblin King. And they're like, whoa, tone it down, dude. Especially the hairdo. All right. I can do it. Uh. Oh. <laughs> Better out than in, I always say. Excusez-moi, mon ami, but I just belched all over you. <laughs> whoa. Gaston. Jeez. Didn't know we allowed the French in here. Let's go explore. Explore time, guys. Uh, since I couldn't crack the code to the middle of that pyramid, that's pretty tough, you know? I mean, uh, you're just trying to, trying to, trying to make it and, and survive in this crazy Robloxian world of theirs, and, and you can't even get past the stupid lava pyramid. 
Oh man, I ate it. I ate it big time. And I'm a fruit. I'm a, I'm a piece of food already. So when I say I ate it, I really ate it. Anyway, guys, well, I, I'm just going to keep wandering around and, and probably never find my way out of this giant maze. But uh, that's okay. You know, what, I, what else do I got to do? Okay, guys. But, uh, yeah, I love you. And uh, remember, uh, always in life, dare to be different. But more importantly than that, never, ever, ever forget to always dare to be silly. You don't take yourself too seriously. Oh, my mouth is killing me right now. Ah! I love you guys. Later.